Introducing to you first, Fanny out of the blue corner. Wearing black trunks, he weighed it officially 152 and one half pounds. Su record profesional excelente con 45 victorias. 31 ganadas por no cap y solamente 4 derrotas. His professional record is outstanding. 45 victories, including 31 knockouts. Just 4 defeats. De Sheffield, Yorkshire, England. He is the number one contender, El Retador, the challenger, Ryan Spice Boy Roll! And his opponent in the esquina roja, con los pantaloncillos verde con dorado y un peso de 69 kilos, 500 gramos. His opponent across the ring, fighting out of the red corner. Wearing green, trimmed in gold, he weighed in officially 153 and one quarter pounds. Su record perfecto. 36 victorias. Un empate. 26 knockouts. His professional record is perfect. 36 victories. One draw. 26 wins coming by way of knockout. El orgullo de Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico. El invicto. El campeón super mundial de CMB, Saúl Canelo Álvarez. I got you the restriction on the, the dressing room. Get a little infection in the camerino. I want a clean fight, okay? Necesito una pelea limpia. You are ready? Tú estás listo? Porque en guante vámonos. Bien. At least he's used to probably seeing this time. A lot of explosive connects to this point. Rose Blunt. Hometown crowd will roar in approval. That time, the right hand got in place by Alvarez. Combination, watch by Rose. Rose likes to switch. I go south block here. Uh, is that Rose has it a little bit more. He likes to switch. Good combination. Alvarez with a right hook over the top. Uppercut to the body from Alvarez. Alvarez just missed the respect for the bad part about it. Right hook, left hand combo from Alvarez. Alvarez from Alvarez. You seem to be a very good combo. 1997. He said, I feel like I'm getting this kid. He might be too dangerous to fight. <laughs> he was actually. And that does tell you a lot about Alvarez. Alvarez on the exchange he lands the bigger punches. Yeah, if Rose would not commit so much to that. Seconds in round number three. Like there as a... Good. So he doesn't do anything crazy. This is the best put out too much trying to get him out of there. Right hand. Double left to the body. Right. Beautiful combination by Alvarez. And Rose is down. of Canelo Alvarez. He sticks to the body, does Alvarez. Rose is in the lion's den and is being covered by Cinnamon. With a right hand, a jab, a double jab, followed by another glancing right hand, hit him behind the head. And I think the kid was sort of off balance, but sometimes those shots behind the head do hurt. They see it. A right hand, followed by a double jab, Get another right hand that kind of caught him on the ear, but it did seem to take his balance because he has because he's going to get caught when he gets that up that gamble. So those good stiff jab. Love the way Alvarez sets things up with body shots. A very comfortable job. He rips another combination, opens up with that left foot, doubles, nothing coming back to close. Too many punches, like I said, at the end of the last round. And Guadalajara, Canelo, Alvarez, and Ryan Rhodes in round number six. For Alvarez's hand that he's landed all night long. <laughs> this round of the fight, period. But that's where he... okay. Rhodes' corner was right when they said don't stand in front of him. But Canelo Alvarez, then the heart of who should be. So Canelo Alvarez doing all the leading, doing all the punches. He's the aggressor. He's winning the...
And Alvarez again. And it wasn't landing enough on Alvarez in order to make up for it. That's a push. Into round number seven. In his career, he's got this round. Alvarez works the box. It's kind of a dangerous spot for low the eye. Alvarez is ending it most of the time with a good body shot. The thing he's been doing nicely in this fight is not at the shot of his own. Doubles up the left. Lowe's is giving it a game effort, but I just don't think he has enough of his attack to do Alvarez any damage. But now Alvarez is really hurting his body bad. Down Rhodes again. Good fucking. The ring on, he's just he's not punching. That was a good shot. Alvarez really kind of taking it easy in the first half. I don't think it really matters much. But you know, Rhodes said he needed a in the power punch to save his power up. But he can't beat him like that. Goes to the body again, right to the ear. Left hand scores. But Alvarez doesn't even have to be concerned about defense because Rhodes is not punching. And his corner told him a couple rounds ago not to go to Southpaw because he's not. Yeah. But the bad part about that, not that. Alvarez touches Rhodes to the body, combination to the head. Hey, Orthodox, don't sweat, it's not working, but he still does. For the knockout. He hasn't given it up yet. Rhodes, combination. He doesn't throw him, he doesn't land him at all. I mean, a loss is a loss whether he gets knocked out or whether he just gives it up. I mean, he hasn't won a round. And he's about to go down anyway. So why not land something while you go? Alvarez opens up and lands a good punch. In. Instead of Rose looking for a knockout, Alvarez is. <laughs> He wants to close the show in his hometown. Rhodes gets rocked. Referee stops it. One month shy of his 21st birthday, Canelo Alvarez gets his 27th stoppage. Does it in the 12th round. Well, he closed out the show, Roy. Yeah, Rhodes Corner said go for the knockout. Canelo took care of that. Yeah, I think I think Dave saw that coming, and I think that's why he tried to send Rhodes out to go for the knockout. So at least if he did get knocked out, he would get knocked out trying. Well, Ryan Rhodes took a pounding, got dropped in the fourth round, and it gets stopped in the 12th. Just did not have enough, Roy, as we take a look at how the fight ended. Yeah, here you see Alvarez on attack with one, two, double hook, hook to the body, double right hand to the head. I mean, you can't act for much better than that. Another one, two, three, four, five punch combination. The referee had to come in. A six punch was on the way. The towel was on the way. Everybody was trying to stop it. Once again, you see the one, two, five by the left uppercut, left body shot, right hook, straight right. Then he comes back with a one, two, a left hook, a right uppercut, another right hand, a jab just in case. That's how you put punches together. Dave Caldwell thrown in the towel. Referee stepped in, and Canelo Alvarez sold close to 12,000 tickets in his hometown of Guadalajara, and everybody except the 20 in the Rhodes traveling party leaves happy. <laughs> uh, but, Roy, you know, he's... Went after the guy's body early. He stayed solid with the body punches. He dug in with his power shots and fought a good disciplined fight. He fought a very disciplined fight. And that's why I said these guys, for some reason, well, I know why they have so many fights and so many amateur fights that they learn the game well. They're very prepared for the professional ranks. So when they turn pro and they're good, they're really good. They're exceptionally good.
And Rhodes, who's campaigned his whole career at 154 and 160, at least as far as the weight class, legitimate. You know, the hat had come all the way up in, in Alvarez's last fight. And Dew was 39. Valdemir was 38. Here's a 34-year-old. And he was just outdone, Ryan Rhodes was. I don't think he ever seen this type of punching power. And the face shows it. To the shoulders goes Canelo. And keeps his 154-pound belt. And Ryan Rhodes' face sort of tells the story. But Ryan Rhodes fought a very gutsy game fight. He gave it all he had. And like I said, to the youngsters out there watching, this is why you try to not go into a fight looking for a knockout. Well, Canelo Alvarez gets his first 12th round stoppage and, uh, you know, a pretty comfortable fight for him, as we mentioned. Nice and disciplined through the course of the fight. And, uh, you know, Ryan Rhodes never able to really hurt Alvarez in this fight. Alvarez dropped Rhodes in the fourth round and finished him off in round number 12. Let's send it up to our ring announcer, Joe Martinez. Estamos en los 48 segundos del último round. El referee para la pelea para el ganador por knockout técnico. The end comes 48 seconds. Round number 12. Your winner by TKO victory. Se mantiene el invicto campeón mundial. Super Werther CMB. And still, the undefeated WBC Super Welterweight Champion of the World.